This is Twisted Maxi, and this is a mod speedrun. Today we're covering Better Build By in under 4 minutes. Better Build By is the ultimate builder suite with a variety of improvements to build by. It includes organized debug, expandable catalog, build mode free cam, build mode light editor, better filters, and more. Do not install expandable catalog or build cam mods if you're using Better Build By. They're included. Go to twistedmexi.com, go to mods, click on Better Build By, read the post, and then click the download at the bottom. Click on the file to open it, you'll see a folder and a file. Drag the TMX Better Build By folder to your mods folder. Open your game, make sure script mods are on in gameplay options, restart if you had to turn it on. It's now installed. If you snoop inside the mod, you'll see two files telling you if you see this, you're installing it wrong. Ignore that if you followed the exact steps I just gave you. They're there to stop people from trying to change or move the mod files. Build by content filters are different, but most find them preferable after getting used to it. The filters stay set when you leave build by or even when you restart your game, so you only have to set them once. Don't use the show live edit or show hidden objects cheats. Instead, use the debug and live edit filters to toggle them. Custom content toggles the custom content, and hide maxis hides all normal objects, meaning any that aren't CC, live edit, or debug. Custom content is off by default, so before you ask where your CC went, please remember to turn that filter on the first time. Pack filters have been improved to have each individual kit instead of a single kit's filter. You can use build cam by pressing tab while in build mode. It uses the same controls as normal free cam. You can activate the expandable catalog by pressing 1 on your number row. It'll switch between the two rows and five rows. Shift click any light while in build mode to bring up the new light editor. You can pick how many lights you'd like to change from the dropdown. To turn on Organize Debug, open Filters and scroll down to Better Build By. Turn the Organize Debug option on. You'll get a pop-up, read it and click OK. Restart your game once and then you're good. Organize Debug does not mark your lot as CC, so no need to turn it off before uploading. Organize Debug categorizes debug and live edit objects. For example, rocks will be in rocks and vehicles in transportation. The objects will be combined into swatches just like normal objects. It also enables you to clone those objects with the eyedropper tool. If you aren't sure what category an object is in, go to browse by function, select debug or live edit from the dropdown, find your object and place it. Use the eyedropper on it to find the category it belongs to. These drop-down categories are only there when organization is on, and don't forget to turn on the filters for each or they'll appear empty. Sometimes organized debug can become out of sync, usually if the game or mod was just updated, you repaired the game, or you deleted resource.config in your mods folder. If this happens, you'll get a desync message. All you'll need to do is leave organized debug off, restart your game once, and then you can turn organized debug back on. If Better Build By says the install is incorrect when you start the game, the mod files were probably moved or renamed and it can't find everything it needs. If Better Build By says that the install is incorrect when you try opening the filter panel, your script mods are probably turned off in gameplay options. If Better Build By doesn't give you an error message at all, but isn't working correctly, you've probably installed a conflicting mod like Edit Lights and Build Mode and those will need removed. If your lot is marked as CC, it's not organized debug, it's because you have actual CC somewhere or more likely a paint by reference picture somewhere on the lot that is flagged as CC. For a clean uninstall, you should always make sure that organized debug is off before removing the mod. There's more tutorials on my channel, use twistedmexy.com to stay up to date. If you'd like to support me, consider joining me on Patreon. Thanks everyone.